And when he speak, things get done. Yes, I have to be survived. They will say, I am my own God. That's what the scoffers were saying. Right. The scoffers cannot set amen, someone free if amen, they are not free themselves. Thank you, Lord. How to be somebody. Yeah. But I want you to know they profess to be saved, but never been amen, redeemed at all. Amen. In order to be saved, you got to be redeemed. Yes, sir. Amen. By the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. Talk to me, somebody. Yes. Oh, yeah. Amen. Listen. Second Peter, amen. Three and nine. The Lord is not slack. Hallelujah. Concerning his promise. As some being cast like this. But he's long suffering to us with. Yes, Lord. Not Jesus. willing that any should perish. Talk to me. God, amen, don't get no pleasure out of killing folks. He get pleasure out of saving people. Yes, Lord. Talk to me, Thank somebody. you, Lord. Oh, yes, the prophet Daniel, amen, shifted, amen, to the end time. Amen. It, amen, the almighty God who assigned power to the kingdom. Amen. And one thing about it, when God does it, even you can't change it. Talk to me, somebody. All right. Amen. And one day, God will judge those kingdoms at the end time. Well, yes, Daniel, amen, say, God will. Amen. Yes. Judge his people at the judgment seat of Christ. We all must stand before the Almighty God Amen. and give an account for our lives. Amen. Jesus is coming for a church that's already ready. Yes. Not get ready. Amen. But already fixed up. Amen. Wrapped up and tied up in Him. Talk to me somebody. Think about this. If your life was judged by God today, what would he say about you? Amen. Gentlemen, amen. Son of song yesterday, and amen. Pastor Grave, amen. Phew. Is the Lord satisfied with me? I'm satisfied with Jesus. Is he satisfied with me? How would God measure if, amen, against his will today? We must live each day with full, amen, assurance how we live our lives. Amen. Yes, the man of God said, Lord, make me to know my end. Talk to me, somebody. And the measurement of my days, what it is, that I may know how frail, and that word frail means weak I am. Talk to me, somebody. Don't you know, and then God is coming. And he says, God, and you must have your suitcase packed. I'm not talking about your suitcase you have at home. I'm talking about, amen, your body, your temple. Amen, fixed up and wrapped up to go with Jesus. Amen. Listen, saints of God, God is coming. Amen. For a church not getting ready, but already ready. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. I have my ticket. Oh, yes. And I hope you have it. Talk to me, somebody. Yeah. The church will be raptured during, amen, the first resurrection. The saints, amen, of God will be caught up to meet the Lord in the air. And that word rapture means snatch in the Greek terminology. Amen. God going to snatch us out of here. In a moment, I'm going to try to remember. Talk to me, somebody. Oh, God told us to preach this. Amen. God told us to keep the saints in the sense of God. Amen. I let it because he's coming for our church. Not get ready, but already ready. 1,000 years later, the second resurrection, after the first resurrection, 1,000 years later, the second resurrection will have a 
amen, the righteous and the wicked in it. Amen. Oh, yes. Amen. The scripture says, Blessed is he that has part in the first reservation, because on the second part has no power. Amen. amen. You don't want to be, amen, saints of God left here for the second reservation. Because the second resurrection, it has no power. But the first resurrection has power. That same spirit that dwells in Jesus Christ shall also quicken your mortal body. In other words, that's the thing going to take you out of here. Talk to me, somebody. That's right. Ah, but the second resurrection doesn't have that kind of power. Why? Because they don't have Holy Ghost. Talk to me, somebody. Thank you, Lord. And they are made uh, to stand before God at the white throne judgment. Uh, talk to me, somebody. Oh, uh, yeah, that's where Jesus will separate the righteous amen from the wicked. Other word, the sheep from the goats. Come on, somebody. As a shepherd dividing, amen, the sheep from the goat. So shall Jesus Christ divide amen, the righteous from the wicked. Amen. In, in this last resurrection are uh, included all the righteous men of all ages uh -huh, who have walked in all the light that was given to them in their day. Oh, uh, yes. Who have never heard. Don't you listen to me good? Who have never heard of the truth of the gospel of God? Uh -huh. Those individuals, one thing about God, God is no respected person. If that person have heard about the Holy Ghost, having heard about being baptized in Jesus' name, God not going to send that person to hell. He's going to give that person in the sense of God life on, on the new earth. Come on, son. Oh, uh, yes, who have never heard of the truth of the gospel of Christ and those who have died during the millennium period, amen, walking in all the light of that time, Thank you, Lord. amen, will be given eternal life here on planet Earth. Thank you. Remember, the church is gone. We out of here. Come on, somebody. Amen. I said, we out of here. Amen. These are the people that God is going to separate the sheep from the goat, the Thank righteous you, from the wicked. Amen. Thank you, Amen. Lord. And if those righteous folks have heard about the Holy Ghost, been baptized in Jesus' name, God is going to give them life here on earth. Amen. So the earth will be made new again. Thank Come you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And they'll be walking on this new earth. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yes, yeah, Lord. Be in heaven and on the new earth. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Here, amen. Saints of God, amen. Walking around in the Bible, so there'll be a tree. Hallelujah. Bearing 12 pounds of fruit. <coughs> amen. Yielding up fruit every month. Other way, one, amen, month, it may bring apples. It may, next month, pears. Next month, whoever seen a tree like that? Yeah. But God can do anything. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. You talk about the man, God. You talk about the God. That's easy to do a bunch of people. We may ask the thing. He can do that yeah. and more. Come to me, somebody. Yeah. There are many righteous folks who have died without the Holy Ghost. Has never even heard about the Holy Ghost. And the question has been asked, where will amen, those righteous amen, people, amen, saints of God, amen, come in at that? But listen, the answer will be they will be given eternal life here on yeah. this new earth. Yes, Lord. Talk to me, somebody. Yeah. Oh, yes. Jesus is coming for a church and the saints of God is already ready. He's not going to catch those righteous folks into hell because they have heard about the Holy Ghost. And then God's going to die. And listen, he's not in a two-faced person. He's not a respected person in the saints of God. But God is able to divide the righteous All right. from the wicked. Yeah. Thank you.
Jesus. That's the kind of God we serve in today. That's the kind of God we have today. That's the kind of God. Amen. We serve. Yes, Remember Lord. you in heaven. Yes, Amen. You have anything to do with this. Amen. When we go to heaven, this earth will be made new again. And I heard Brother John said, I saw a new heaven and a new earth. Because the first heaven, that's the old earth. And then the first heaven, earth was passed away. Yes. And there will be no more what? No more sin. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. To know and the saints of God. God is coming. Bless her, Lord. Bless her, Jesus. Bless her, Lord. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Give her eternal life. Amen. On this new earth. But listen, let me inject something while I'm here at this point. If they have heard about the Holy Ghost, if they have heard about the baptism in Jesus' name and rejected it, then they won't have this opportunity, amen, here on this new earth. But if they have heard about it and rejected it, then they're standing at the white throne judgment to be judged, amen, by God. Talk to me, somebody. Talk to me, somebody. Oh, hallelujah. They shall, amen, inherit. Even the Bible said the righteous, new, uh, new, amen, on the new earth, they shall inherit, amen, eternal life. Amen, where eternal life will be given them here on the new earth. There will be. Amen. No more death. No more. Amen. Sorrow. Amen. No more pain. For the former things are passed away. What even I am even concerned about is why will you be? Amen. At this time, will you be ready to meet the Lord in the hour? Amen. The rapture and go through the tribulation period. I want you to know that all the time. People don't want you to preach about him in the tribulation period. But just as sure as you sit there in those pews and in my this boy, that will be seven years of tribulation. After this church is taken out of here, a million in the tribulation period means we're saying. Yeah. 